controller of customs, Roger Prado, says a general change in mindset is necessary when it comes to the way the agency conducts business at the airport. We have visitors coming in, right? Why they come here to just spend some time uh, holidaying here? So they would bring a lot of, uh, you know, gear with them, like for example, surfing gear, swim gear, swim gear, swim gear, and you know, some electronic uh, toys for the kids so that you know kids could be enjoyed. All those things. And if we start to you know opening all their bags and you know embarrassing them, you know, what is this and what is that? It's not a good feeling for any visitor to come and spend some time with us. We need to change our mindset. I'm not saying don't collect any revenue at the airport. We have to collect, but we know who are those commercial peddlers. We would have, over a period of time, we would have built up a lot of profiles on a local business people who would go to St. Martin, go to Miami, go to New York, and uh, come with the bags loaded with all kinds of, you know, uh, uh, you know, merchandise. You know them, identify them, just pull them apart for, from the queues, right? And transfer all those bags to the air cargo where they'll be properly processed, right? And your job, our job at the airport should be, okay, to really see the passenger facilitation is of highest quality and, uh, you know, the experience, visitor experience is of you know, world class standard. That's where I want to go. This is, I've spoken to my officers and staff, and most of them are on board. We don't have any problem. The customs controller says new regulations governing these procedures are currently being drafted, and he describes them as improvements that the public would love. Sharice Constant, PBS News.